Ali from Blackbird Energy and this is a training video on how to replace a broken piece of glass on the Green One Tech soda collectors. This system is in the Klein Karoo in South Africa um, in a very dry and, and rocky area, ideal for solar heating. But in the process of clearing away the bushes and shrubbery, um, using a bush cutter, rocks were um, shot up by the machine and fractured the glass. And because it's a safety glass, it's completely disintegrated. So let's start with the process of replacing the glass and, and step by step what is required to, to do that effectively. So why do we replace the glass and not leave it open? First of all, this blue selective coating needs to be protected. Um, it absorbs energy but as well radiates energy and if this panel um, the selective coating gets damaged um, it's less efficient in terms of heating up and attracting that heat and displacing that you can see the back serpentine panels where the fluid flow to then transfer that heat over to the panel so in the collector at all costs we want to protect this coating and also the glass helps to make the panel a lot more efficient um, so if you have a glass that gets broken, immediately cover the panel to protect the selective coating and secondly, uh, try and replace it as quickly as possible. So let's start with the process. You'll see in the manual, the first process refers to removing these corner pieces. The second step is then to loosen that top rail. next step is then to loosen the side rails on each side of the glass that holds it in position and that's done by just loosening these little screws that hold it in place. The next step is to make sure that the area is cleaned properly. You don't want any rocks or hard pieces that can damage the glass. Clean that all out effectively 
and ensure that the entire panel and the, the channels is cleaned out. Placing the glass upright helps it to get it in position in the gap. No. Yeah. Nice and gentle yeah. Yeah. Again we've bent open the corners to ensure that there's no edge on the glass to possibly risk it uh, getting a nick and, and shattering. So now the glass is in position, it's on the inside like edges. Perfect, perfect, perfect. And we can proceed to put on the edging again. That concludes the process of successfully replacing your glass on your solar collector. Thank you for watching. Remember to like and subscribe so that you can be notified of future video releases. Follow us on www.blackdotenergy.co.za. Special thanks given to the Soul Train program and to the maintenance team at CKI.